Hello again, Evergreen Traders and Investors. We are back to our Equitalk series and we are already on our episode number 107. Today is February 13, 2020. In this 107th episode, I will be talking about my analysis and I'll give you my I'll be giving you my recommendations for Ayala Land Logistics Holding Corporation or Ayala Land Logistics Holdings Corporation with a stock code of ALLHC. And by the way, my name is JC De Guzman, founder and CEO of Equidist Analytics Incorporated. By the end of this analysis, I am going to answer this question. Is Ayala Land Logistics Holdings Corporation or is 2 pesos and 48 centavos a strong support for Ayala Land Logistics? We will find out. I will let you know. I am going to help you how to determine or how to identify a data-driven answer for that question. But first things first, we need to talk about my technical analysis that is based on my evergreen strategy in trading and investing in the Philippine stock market. Just a brief introduction, this evergreen strategy works whether you are into short-term trading or long-term investing, whether it's a bearish or a bullish market. That's why I call it as an evergreen strategy. It doesn't mean, however, that you're not going to get any loss, any uh, any uh, losses just because of the word evergreen. Okay, so don't take it literally. All right, take it logically. And I'm sure you'd like to know. Some of you'd like to know uh, what's uh, what what you're going to learn from this online stock market course called the Evergreen Strategy. To know more to know more about this online stock market course or online stock market seminar. Visit our website at equilis.com and then click on the course menu on top. Alright, so let's talk about ALLHC right now. So I'm looking at the daily chart here. So today, Thursday, it closed at 2.5. Support is at 2.48. Resistance is at 2.84. As you can see right here, it's on the brink of breaking, breaking below the support level at 2.48. Today, Foreign investors registered a net foreign buying worth 20,000 pesos. Well, that's a relatively insignificant amount, so we're not going to, do, to dwell. We're not going to dwell that much on that number. For year-to-date foreign fundies remain net sellers. The 10 smack D of Ayala Land Logistics is bearish. So at this point, at this early, I'm telling you there is no buy signal confirmation yet for Ayala Land Logistics. Okay, now the risk level of uh, Ayala Land Logistics is already moderate due to its historical volatility score of 62%. And right now I know you are already asking what on earth a 10 SMACD is. How does it become bullish or bearish? What's in it if, if it's bearish or bullish? And why is he checking the risk level of a stock using the historical volatility score? Those questions and even more are already answered in my online stock market course or online stock mar market seminar. Again, visit equities.com and then click on the course menu on that page. Now, I also see here on the DMI chart of Ayala Land Logistics that the downtrend is more than likely to continue. Why? Because the negative DMI is moving higher than the positive DMI and ADX is already higher than 25 points. That's another confirmation of the growing strength of the downward momentum. All right. Now, based on my trade and volume distribution analysis, Ayala Land Logistics has a volume weighted average price of 2.52. And luckily for Ayala Land today, that uh, you know the the, the VWAP, VWAP being higher than the last price, that makes a bearish momentum power indicator. And when uh, the momentum power indicator is bearish, that also means that there is no buy signal confirmation. Okay, This momentum power indicator has four elements. When one of those four elements is uh, bearish, it makes the entire momentum power indicator bearish. You will learn more about these, what these uh, four elements are, and how to measure their 
status, how do they become bearish, how do they become bullish, etc. in the online stock market course. Okay? Another thing, another another thing, the dominant range of Ayala Land Logistics is between 2.5 to 2.53, which is closer to the intraday low than the intraday high. That's another reason why the momentum power indicator of Ayala Land Logistics is bearish. On the other hand, the true market sentiment of Ayala, Ayala Land Logistics is bullish. So how are we going how are we going to use that information when it comes to decision making? So here you go. I'm going to answer the question now. Is 2.48 a strong support? Remember, 2.48 is the immediate support of Ayala Land Logistics. Once it breaks below 2.48, we're looking at 2.2 as the next support level. The answer to the question is no. 2.48 does, doesn't seem to be the uh, strong support for Ayala Land Logistics. But there's, but there's a chance, there's a probability for this stock to uh, try to maintain its position higher than 2.48 because of that bullish true market sentiment. But once it touches 2.48 and once the volume bar maintains its uh, green co uh, red color and if it's higher than the 50% of the stock's 10-day volume average, then it will be more likely for the price to test 2.2. So the answer to the question is a no. Okay, So if you still have Ayala Land Logistics, ALLHC, and by the way, this is under the assumption that your trailing stop is still intact. Okay, If you still have Ayala Land Logistics, I would recommend that you reduce the percentage of risk on your trailing stop. Don't just hold your position. That is not enough. It's more than, The downtrend is more than likely to continue. So don't average down. It's a waste of buying power. If you don't have Ayala Land Logistics, I would suggest not to buy it yet. To be specific, wait for the tense MACD and the momentum power indicator to become bullish before you consider doing a test buy, before you calculate your reward to risk ratio. Okay? So... It's a bearish uh, rating for Ayala Land Logistics. Now, if you are one of our customers, if you are one of our subscribers of our stock market subscription service, you may ask for this stocks for our latest analysis and recommendation for Ayala Land Logistics or even for any other stock that is listed in the Philippine Stock Exchange you know, in our private clients forum. You can ask there. You can post your question there. All right, and uh, when you become one of our subscribers, there are six inclusions. Number one, you will receive a daily video with 10 trade ideas. This video that you're listening to or watching to right now, it only has one trade idea. I am only discussing one stock. But if you are a subscriber, okay, the video that you're going to watch every single day, except holidays and weekends, contains 10 trade ideas for 10 different stocks, okay? Number two, you will receive an access to our investment guide for long-term investing. I personally monitor all 30 blue chip companies. Whenever I see a buy signal confirmation, you will know it's on the table. And you will also know the dominant range where it is best for you to do a test buy or top up, okay? Number three, you will get access to our private clients forum. That is where you can request for our latest analysis and recommendation. And number four, if you, you can submit your analysis in our private clients forum inside the study room. We're going to check your analysis, give you a score, and give you uh, a recommendation on how you can make a better analysis so that you can execute better. And number five, if your analysis is really that good, then we're going to publish it on our website with your permission, provided we have your permission. We're going to put your picture as the author. We're going to put your author's biography. And we're going to insert your affiliate URL so that when someone subscribes through your affiliate link, you will get a 20% commission. That is our Learn and Earn Affiliate Program, or LIP. 
And last but not the least, you will get a free online stock brokers account from First Metro Securities plus two months of free access to First MetroSec Pro. It is the most advanced online stock trading platform in the Philippines today. Again, to subscribe, visit equilis.com and then click the subscribe page or menu on top. All right, and uh, I would also like to, you know, uh, invite you to uh, register, sign up to our newsletter so that when we publish a new episode like this one, you will receive an email. And how do you subscribe or sign up to our to our free newsletter? Just go to equilis.com and then you click on uh, resources. Okay, take a look at this video. Click on resources and then click on learn. And then you will see an, an, an orange button. Click it, sign up, check your inbox for the confirmation email. If it's not there, check your, your spam or junk folder. Once confirmed, and that's it, it's finished. Also, follow us on all of our social media accounts. There's a description box down below. Click those links. We're, we're on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, Pinterest, Tumblr, LinkedIn, SoundCloud, YouTube. We're all over. <laughs> so follow us using on your favorite social media network so that aside from that automatic email, automated email on our newsletter, you will also be alerted through your social, uh, favorite social media account when we publish an announcement that we already have a new episode. All right, it's, it's for free anyway, so there's nothing to lose. All right, so again, thank you for listening or watching to our Equitox episode number 107. My name is Jay-Z de Guzman, and if you have follow-up questions, you may comment down below. Always remember, be evergreen.